What's going on YouTube? It's Fizzy here and today we're going to be talking about what I've been up to and future plans for the channel, I guess. So, first off, I want to say thank you guys so much for a thousand subs. Fucking mind-blowing. I really appreciate it. Also, um, me and Chronix, who is one of the kids I coach for Unite Gaming, the Halo team, um, we're going to be doing a podcast series where we're going to be talking about like the AM scene and, you know, some of the substances that are being used within the am scene that people really don't talk about i feel like people should be exposed for it not like to ruin their lives but i don't know if we're gonna say like names or anything like that we're just gonna go over dosages and stuff like that that we know of and that i personally have heard of people using so if you guys like that kind of stuff you know make sure to like the video and i guess comment about it um so i'm gonna be streaming on youtube and facebook gaming from now on um facebook gaming i used to stream on there a lot to be honest uh when Modern warfare the 2019 one came out um so i'm planning on going back there but i'm gonna be multi-streaming so i'm gonna stay away from twitch due to you know i don't know the lack of community on twitch for halo isn't really there anymore um halo infinite is kind of dead now which is tough but it is what it is we'll keep it moving and you know youtube i really want to focus on making content for it and really just building my brand around youtube and you know over the last like two months i would say that i've been going through a lot mentally and uh i guess emotionally through a breakup and i kind of lost like my love for gaming and my love for making content and stuff like that so i did take a break in july for about two or three weeks um you know it was a tough decision and you know i still uh, respect the person that i was with but it just didn't work out and we decided to part ways um other than that man i'm just looking forward to making more content and making more youtube videos like this where i can really express myself and kind of like do more with my content and actually like kind of help people which has always been the goal for the channel you know i never wanted people to feel alone um i talked about in a video before where i just felt lonely and i feel like a lot of people feel like that especially in the gaming scene where you don't really have a lot of irl friends like me personally i don't um you know i'm kind of staying away from the dating scene for right now um i actually got rejected for having adhd and being on the spectrum which was a very interesting deal i've never been rejected for that and honestly that really really like i'll be honest that really fucked me up like emotionally and just mentally because i feel like my self-worth wasn't important to people and you know whether i have adhd or i'm on the spectrum in some way um i really don't feel like that's who i am as a person and i don't feel like people should judge me based off of that but that's when the villainy arc started and the villainy arc is just a fun fucking gag thing that i like to do um you know, I feel like, you know, I've been a lot, I've been way too nice to people, in honesty. Like, I have just been the nice guy. I've always been nice guy fizz and shit like that. Like, it's just not working. You know, nobody really respects me in the scene. And that's fine. You know, I never wanted anybody's respect. I just wanted people to like me. And I feel like that's where I went wrong. To where I felt so self-conscious about posting any clips or really just trying to enjoy the game in my way. And... I got, I'll be honest, man, like, I don't know if I want to say this on camera or not, but, um, mentally, I've been in a dark place for a long time, like, probably seven years or so, um, and honestly, man, it's just been a rocky road for me, um, mental health has always been something I struggle with, and I feel like self-worth and self-love is more important to me right now than chasing women or even trying to date or even having conversations with people anymore. I just feel like it's not for me. And maybe one day I'll find somebody and maybe I'll die alone. Like honestly, man, I just don't care anymore. Like I'm so over it. I just want to be happy and I just want to feel fulfilled. And it's like, I hit a thousand subs, dude. And I remember just sitting there and I literally started crying because I realized like how much it meant to me and how my brain's gonna work is that it's not gonna be enough. It's never 
it's never going to be enough, you know, and it's just a really, really bad cycle of grinding and getting better and better and better and better and doing more and more and more and more and more to where like I neglected like real life shit. Like I neglected family members and neglected um, relationships with different partners and stuff. And I feel like it's time to learn balance. And honestly, man, like I want to do YouTube. I want to make YouTube like a full time living. I want to make money off of doing YouTube. That's my goal. And, you know, you might say, like, oh, that's, you should want to do it for the love. I'm doing it for the love, but I also want to make money because I'm realistic. Like, no, honestly, man, you should be, you should love what you do, but you also make, you should also make money from it. And, honestly, man, like, coaching has been such an experience for me, and I just enjoy every single minute of it when I did. Right now, we're on a hiatus um, until next year. Hopefully, uh, Chronix is going to live in Nebraska with me. And I'm going to focus on losing weight and stuff like that. Because my weight has gone up since trying to date. It may not look like I'm like super, super obese or anything like that. I'm really not obese, but I just feel like I can be healthier. And I'm kind of neglecting my health for the grind, essentially. And I barely even do any grinding. Like, honestly, man, it's all um, trying to figure out things you know i just want to be the best i can be and whether it lives up to somebody else's expectations or not it doesn't matter to me i just want to be happy i just want to feel fulfilled at the end of the day that's all you can really ask for anymore and i want to say you know from the bottom of my heart guys i'm like really really um happy that i hit a thousand subs and you know hopefully we can hit two thousand subs by the end of the year it's kind of the goal um so yeah i just want to say thank you so much for all the love and support um my youtube stream got like eight views 10 views and that was really exciting like i've never been happier i, I kind of wanted to cry to be honest like i remember <laughs> live streaming it i just wanted to like break down because i didn't think that would ever happen you know i just never thought about that um that I could actually get people to watch my streams and stuff because it's not really a streaming channel but i'm going to be doing live streams on here five times a week um probably i'll probably figure out a schedule uh, no honestly like just trying to figure out a schedule here um other than that man that's gonna be it uh doomsday profits third episode should be coming out next week yeah next week and then we'll probably, I'll probably be the, I might, I'm going to see if I can get Chronix to like record. I know he's been having some, uh, like a rough time right now. He's been going through depression and stuff too. So uh, hopefully we can get something working, get together. But I just want to say, I really appreciate you guys stopping by the channel and show me so much love and support. And here's to 2000 subs, hopefully by the end of the year. I appreciate you. The villain Fizzy is here to stay and as cheesy as it is i feel like that was really fucking cringe but i appreciate you guys and let's get it have a good one appreciate you see you next time